Fighting is never fun, and it's not safe either. And fighting never really solves a problem. Fighting just makes things worse. Let's find out ways to solve problems. Let's go. One day, Jen woke up late. It was a school day and she'd have to hurry to make the bus. She gathered up her homework, books, pencils, and other things she needed for school and stuffed it all inside her backpack. And then she ran out the door to the bus stop. Meanwhile, Lucy was already at the bus stop. When the bus arrived, Lucy got in line, got on the bus, and took a seat by herself. Jen made the bus just in time and sat down next to Lucy. Jen didn't have time for breakfast, so she looked through her backpack for a granola bar. But as she looked through her backpack, her elbow hit Lucy. It was an accident, and Jen didn't even know she did it. Lucy didn't say or do anything about it. But all of a sudden, Jen remembered that she had to bring her money in for the field trip. Her mom put an envelope with the money inside on the kitchen table last night. Did she remember to put it inside her backpack? As she looked through her backpack, her elbow kept poking Lucy. Jen wasn't paying attention, and Lucy thought she was doing it on purpose and got mad. So she decided to poke Jen back with her elbow. Jen got mad and poked Lucy on purpose. Pretty soon, they were poking each other back and forth, back and forth, and it hurt. Ow, stop poking me. You stop poking me. You stop first. You stop, you started it. Little problems can easily turn into a big fight, but it doesn't have to happen that way if you keep your hands down and use your words. Let's see how Lucy and Jen could avoid a fight and solve the problem before it starts when they keep their hands down and use their words. Hey, why'd you poke me? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't know. Hey, you're poking me again. Oops, sorry, I'm trying to look for something. Can I help? Sure. Thank you for helping me. You're welcome. <laughs> you go. You go. You go. No. You go. We. When you have a problem with someone else, you don't have to hit or poke each other. Remember, hands down and use your words. Lucy told Jen that she was poking her. Jen told her it was an accident. Use your words. Talk to each other. It's a great way to work things out. on here.